So here we have a little bug that's going to be helping this bug set up a village. First things first, we gotta clear out all these rocks by bashing them with a stick. This poor little bug doing all the physical labor while that guy just stands there with a hammer. But once we clear out enough rocks here, we can put in a house. A big old house for me and only me. But we need to get some more things that we can build. So to do that, we just march into a dark, desolate forest and survive a whole bunch of things that want to kill us. 24 waves of things to be exact. Ow! That was rude. But there's also trees trees that fall down and give us some good things like money and then we get some upgrades like a leaf barrier sounds like a good idea and there's whoa okay whatever those things are is like weird what even are those they look like ticks gross ow and they're hitting me more that's rude oh because there's a big bat right here he's big and blue that would be that do just need to get some more upgrades hopefully before i take him out or i take him out anyway that'd be nice hey i took him out anyway that's nice so now we get a chest with Bruh. an upgrade to the one thing that we have, base damage up. I guess there were two things, but we got base damage up anyway. And we are getting hit fairly often, so let's get some damage reduction. Oh, like that right there. There's so many good things over here. I need to make sure I get those. Hey, hey and ooh, a bomb? Lobs behind the character. I like that idea. So if I just face away, oh yeah, just blowing up all the things right away. Not doing the most damage, just not taking them out in one go. But any little bit helps, I suppose. Could I get another tree, please? You seem to be dodging all the things. How is this only wave three? This is ridiculous. Ridiculous. I need to be collecting some more experience so I get more upgrades. Fortunately, there's a whole bunch of that everywhere. And ooh, we could get some bees, but I should probably upgrade the things that I have already. So let's get another seed bomb for two projectiles. Just all the bombs right in their faces. And the leaf barrier seems to be doing pretty good for us as well. I think I'm out running the bugs a little too quickly. The bombs aren't reaching them anymore. Oh, and the gate doesn't open until 21? Or does that just mean 21 more waves? Anyway, there's Venus fly traps now. I'm not a fly. Get away from me. I am being chased around in a circle here. Oh, and the acorn is right next to that thing. Ow. They don't deal a whole lot of damage, but I feel like that's going to stack up very quickly. Oh, another blue thing. What even kind of bugs are these? They're not really bugs. They're bats. How are there bats the size of bugs? Or am I just a super big bug? I like that idea more. I also like the idea of getting another upgrade, please, pretty soon. Ooh, please have some health on this tree here. Nope. Uh, why is it always money? Money is not sounding very good anymore. Come on, tree. Give me some health things. Uh, more money. Is this what I get for being greedy? I'm also not getting another upgrade as soon as I would like. Oh, gosh. And there's fly traps everywhere. Goodness. At least they go down. Do they even drop XP? They really don't, do they? Well, that's just annoying. Can't you at least be good for me? No. Oh, but I took out the big bat. Oh, no. Okay, I gotta circle again to get that chest. And on the way over there, I should collect enough gems to get an upgrade. Oh, good. Ooh, a thorn whip. Sprouts from the ground makes a long vertical whip attack. That sounds like a good... Okay, that's a very good thing. I like that. Now we just need to get the chest. And there we go. What do we get? Hey, more damage to the thorn whip. I like the idea. Ow, ow. Okay, but more damage goes my way too. Not good. Just because I ran into things. But, oh, that hit so many enemies. Okay, that's very good. Whoa, that guy's big and red. Ah! Right away, he's almost as fast as me. Is he as fast as me? I don't like that idea. Go away. Hit him with a thorn whip. And do it again. Hit him. Smack him. Yeah. Smack the little spider. He's not even a little spider. He's just big and scary. But all this XP should help me keep up with that. Is... Oh, is that a magnet? Oh, I need to get that. That probably collects everything. Come on. Just go around the bugs. And then get the tree. More money. Yay. Okay. Spiders don't really go down in one hit unless they're hit with the thorn whip. That's not a good thing. Oh, but the big guy's dead. That's another chest. Uh, I need that magnet. I need the magnet, but it's hard to get the magnet. But at least I can circle around here well enough to get to the chest, which is also right next to a fly trap. Hey, and reduces the cooldown of the thorn whip. Our thorn whip is getting some very sweet upgrades. All right, I'm gonna try and go for the magnet. Uh, ooh, upgrades. Oh, dash cooldown reduction? Sure. And then, whoop, get through there. Yes, collect everything. Almost enough for another level already. Wow. And the acorn that's up there is in the corner of the map. I don't like that idea. So let's go. Hey, there's a hard pickup. Ooh, good. And it has some pretty good regeneration there. So the gate... Okay, yeah. I need to survive until wave 21 for that to open. And then I can get out of here. But it is getting even more hard to... That was, that was a sentence. But okay, things definitely cooled down after that big spider went away. I like that idea. But now my stick isn't smacking them in one go. I have to hit them twice. So whatever this next upgrade is, I need a better stick. Hey, and I get a better stick. Cooldown reduction. Sure. I like things hitting more frequently. Especially that thorn whip. That is just amazing. Oh, oh, that's a big fly trap and he's moving. 
That is breaking all the rules. Ooh, another magnet. Yes. That wasn't as many as last time, though. Oh, but ooh. Oh, hey, that lantern zapped them. Aha, clear them all out. Take off the big flytrap, actually. But oh, the new enemies aren't getting frozen either. That's not a good thing. I need to keep moving just because of them. That's annoying. All right, but can I start smacking the big flytrap? He's kind of just staying out of the way of danger because I'm outrunning everything else that spawned at once. Okay, but the other thing is I am charging up this ultimate ability. It's at 75% now. What is that? Is that a can? It's like an energy thing. Does that increase my attack speed? I need to see it happen. Ooh, an upgrade's happened. Base damage up by five? Yes, please. So I can get these close things away from me. Oh, and there's another red spider. I don't like you. Let me get the can. Banish. Ooh. Oh, they charged up my thing. Aha, ultimate ability. Spin like crazy, tornado of death. Oh, that just killed everything that was following me. And the big fly trap. And the red spider. So good. Exoskeleton gets upgrade. Okay, rush through here, get the chest. And then dash cooldown reduction. Neat. Ah, I'm stuck. Oh no, that was bad. Oh, yikes. I don't know what I got stuck on, but that was very not good. Can I have like a full health pickup now, please? If I ask nicely enough. Oh, that's some health back. Yay. At least I can see my health bar now. And there's so many good things in the middle too, like these big experience gems. Yay. Horizontal slash behind the character. Sure. That'd be helpful. And then get this tree right here, please. How is it always money? Now, whoa, what is that? That's a giant spider. Ah! Get away from me. Get away from me. He has so much health. How is he not going down super fast? Oh, I wish I had that ultimate ability right now. Can this be an energy can, please? It's a hard pickup. Okay, I'll take it and then run away. Ah, he's right on my heels. Do bugs even have heels? Oh my, it's only wave 11. This is not looking good. Okay, but there's a lot more acorns, so maybe one of them has something I can use. Go away. That one was money. I'm getting hit more often. That's not good. That's also money. And what is that? That's, a, that's just a lizard running in the most weird pose I've ever seen. Ah, ah. I'm slowly taking care of the big spider, but I don't have the health numbers to keep up with this. Okay. This might be a make or break upgrade. Two vines sprouting from the ground. That could be really good. Just hit him twice. Oh dear. I'm backing myself into a corner and dash away. Ooh, ah! Get out of here. Okay. Two vines seems to be working, but there's still so many enemies and I am corralled to the corners of the map here. And there's also no more acorns of spawning and now there's birds. Why does everything have it out for me? Oh, now there's a big red lizard too. Oh dear. Ah! Oh, I got stuck there for a second. Oh, there's an acorn somewhere right there. Ah, I don't think I can reach that. I gotta try it. I gotta try it. Maybe it's good. Oh, that's not good. It's money. It's money. I'm going down here unless I actually don't. I'm alive. No, 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 I'm not. I was eaten. Ooh, but we did get some new upgrades and some new blueprints for our base. That's exactly what I wanted. Like a library. Oh, and the more we build, the more stats go up. So we can, ooh, here we go. We could place down a library. Oh man, that's a big library. So we just clear out some more rocks and the rocks also give us some more money. I like the idea. Here we go. We place this right back here and now we get some extra XP when we fight. Ooh, and there's also a statue to me that I can build. Oh, just place that right in front of my door. Look at that thing. That is shiny. That's almost a little too shiny. I can't even look at it properly. Can I go in the library? Oh, I can. Wow. Ooh, and I can unlock a new area. This looks way better than a dark forest. Oh, and we're attacking birds right away. Lovely. Well, they should be giving us more XP because of that library that we built. I like this look a lot more, although it is a smaller area, but we also only have to survive 11 waves. Oh, and of course, the tree drops health when I don't need it. Thank you, game. Very funny. Okay, making sure we upgrade the stick Hello. right away. But whoa, okay, that's a lot of things that spawned already. What even are those? They look like seas, but they also got little mole noses. I guess it's just moles coming to get me. Oh, and a big Venus flytrap already. This is like a speed run mode, but I get a little more XP. Ooh, and this is something new. A concussive blast. Oh, a damageless blast. Ooh, but it pushes enemies away. I like the idea. So if I go whack and then, yeah, they did push back a little bit. Not much though, although it's enough in a pinch. Hey, and we took out the flytrap. So we just casually work our way around and get the chest. Please upgrade the stick. Hey, it upgraded the stick. Fair cooldown. Oh, and another upgrade already. A small bee attacking. That sounds fun. He's just a little buzzing out and then bap, just dive bombing them. Oh, when they're already dead. But he gets something, so good for you. Also, I have definitely heard that pushback sound effect before. Ooh, ooh, an acorn falling from the sky. I need to see this, especially on that spider that's right on my tail. Whoa, that looked good. 
taking out a lot of things. Crushing a random enemy, it said. Can the random enemy be the one that's like right on my tail? It looks like it is actually. More often than not. Hey, and I got it in record time too. Don't mind me just casually pushing my luck by rolling into the enemies. And I just need to... Ah, it does push back the flowers. I wasn't sure if it did because they don't really move. But I mean, if the big fly traps can move around, why can't I? But now there's a lot thicker amount of enemies and I feel like I'm keeping a little too much distance if my stick is a big damage dealer. But then again, the acorn is too, so it kind of evens out. Well, either way, the fly traps are getting a little too populous. Oh, and here's the lizards again in more recent times. And I got some armor on them already too. That's kind of ridiculous. Ooh, but this is a good amount of XP here. And there's a lot more lizards spawning now. What is their deal? What did I ever do? At least the pushback is working nicely and money is actually pretty helpful. Hopefully this area has a blueprint. That's another building. Oh, big red lizard. There's two big red. What? How are there so many big red lizards? Is this just a normal thing now? Are they, or are they the special ones that drop chests? I don't even know. Okay, wave six. We're halfway through here. Ooh, good. More stick damage. That's what I need right now. Even though the big lizards kind of shrug it off right now. That's not ideal. Oh, and that's a big red spider on me. I didn't even notice you. You get kind of lost in the crowd there. Also, my ultimate is only 50% charged right now. This is going way too slow. And the horde is almost always red things now. That, ooh, the red spider died. See what I mean? He just got lost in the crowd. I didn't even recognize that he was damaged. At least the red birds are going down in one strike from the stick. That's way more comforting than I thought it would be. And we, ooh, more max health. Very good. Ah, I got stuck again. Thorn whip. Ah, oh gosh. Getting stuck on, am I getting stuck on the chest? That's very counterintuitive. Oh, and the fly traps are back. Yay. Oh, speed increased. Is that what I need? I think this is the speed that I need. There we go. Now I can outrun the horde way better. Ooh, and then run into something else that wants to kill me. Beautiful. Exactly what I wanted. And the horde is a lot smaller now because the enemies are getting replaced by fly traps. You know, that's something I can work with. I can move around the fly traps or, or just, you know, oh, the zap. I need the zap. All right, wave eight. Just need three more waves. Oh, get the zap. Aha, yes. All the bugs go down. And the lizards. I forgot lizards were a thing. Oh, that's a big lizard. He's the one that drops the chest. Whoa, and there's, okay, all the lizards. Why do these enemies got to spawn after I... Got the zap lantern. Ooh, firecracker sounds exciting though. And I can get a carpenter. So then once we return home and then clear out even more things to get the real estate that I need. Gotta clear out some of these big rocks too that take up way more time to destroy and get through you. Ooh, but it did drop more money. I like the idea. And there's another big rock here that's purple. Is this even more money? It's glowing when I smack it. So that's a good sign. If you don't know what it is, just hit it with a stick. Oh yeah, that was like, I don't even know how much that was, like 200 more monies. I will take all the money that I can get, except when I'm trying to fight things. I would use a lot less money there and more health. Oh, well, let's just put in the carpenter and then it says we can purchase blueprints. What sort of blueprints can I purchase? Hey, it's you again. I was wondering where you went. What do we got? Some pottery, some fences. This is pointless. You are pointless. I mean, I guess I could place some trees around because enrichment means I get better things. Place a tree over there and then on this side of the library. Some bushes in front of the doors. Oh, perfect right there. Oh, wait, there's companion slots? I have companions? I have a companion there and I have just enough money to unlock a slot for it. Yes, please. Oh, he's a companion. Maybe he's not so pointless after all. Okay, let's go back to the dark forest because we got better rewards there. So is he like a damage dealer? What sort of companion are you? And, whoa, ooh, he's a fighter. I like this. I'm sorry about anything I ever said to you, Antonio. Let me increase my damage to keep up with you. He does 21 damage when he does that. That is amazing. That's more damage than I do. Oh, maybe it isn't. I did 31 damage there. Keep up, Antonio. But hey, when the enemies get numerous like they are right now, he's going to be super effective. And he doesn't take damage either. Ooh, he just cleared out that entire mess right there. Beautiful. And he took out the big thing. Thank you. Dash cooldown reduction and upgrade the stick. Oh my gosh, I get damage again. Do I just get stuck in the chest? Is that what's damaging me? I have no no idea what's going on there, but I, ooh, a fun guy. Hey, the game is complimenting me. Throw a mushroom, creates damaging spores. Ooh, I am intrigued. Aha, so it just damages the enemies when they run into it. 
Well, that's fun. Just keep everybody running into it, especially right in the mess of them. I love it. I'm feeling a lot better about taking out that giant spider when it rolls around again. Is it way too early to say that? Maybe, but Antonio here doesn't care. He's just smacking all of them. Oh, and his damage went up too. Does his damage scale with my level? I like the idea. I need to scale up my damage. I just need to make sure to pick up all the experience crystals before I forget about them and get the trusty thorn whip attack because it's beautiful. Oh, and now we're getting the fly traps again. That just happened to be super annoying. At least we're damaging the big blue bat over and over again. So you went down super fast. Now give me that and don't get stuck in the chest this time. Hey, the fungi upgraded. There we go. Now we're alive. Ooh, it got a bigger area. I like the idea and there's more of them. And Antonio's just having a grand old time slamming his hammer. I dare a big red spider to show up now. Just running through the mess of the fly traps. Ooh, there's a firecracker. I need to see this. So throw the firecrackers. Hey, cute little explosions. I need to upgrade those because they only do single digits worth of damage. Oh, that is brutal. Hey, there's a big red spider. Just immediately getting smacked by a thorn vine. Come on, take you down, take you down. Smack him, Antonio. Smack him with a hammer. Yes. At least all the tiny guys are getting taken out in one hit still. And the bats are getting bigger too. And there's a big fly trap. Let's just ignore you for now. It's also incredibly slow, which I'm thankful for. So we can just stay in one spot and then get smacked by everything else dying around him. And oh man, Antonio is like the best companion ever. I love the big hammer smack. Boom. Can you smack the big fly trap? Oh, it was a little out of range. Okay, I'm starting to get cornered a little more because there's so many new things that show up and I'm trying to run through the middle to get some XP, but they don't like that idea for whatever reason. And at least I'm all dying in the middle is keeping all the experience in one spot. Hmm, base damage up by 10 or do I upgrade the dashing again? I'm using the dashing a lot. I should upgrade that. And, oh, there's the ultimate. Yes, use it. Aha, take out the big red spider. Take out the fly trap too, hopefully. Oh, the big red spider did not go down. Hey, there he went down. Okay, now there's two chests right next to each other. Oh, I'm sorry. Do I have my ultimate again already? I'm gonna save my ultimate until that giant spider shows up. And we'll get some shiny green crystals too that are worth more XP. Ooh, I can dash further? I like the idea. Especially since I am now taking more damage without healing. Can I please heal? That, I don't think that healed. Hey, there's a big spider. Take up, uh, uh, excuse me. I'm pressing the button. I. Uh, why is my ultimate not working? Oh no, I don't have it. It bugged. A game about bugs is bugged. At least I can outrun him better now for reasons. And he's getting smacked by Antonio, so that's also good things. Okay, I'm staying way more ahead of it now, so I'm a little more comfortable with how my situation is. Big spiders with the egg sacks are also going down quicker, which I like. Okay, he's getting close. Oh, that ultimate is taunting me. Why don't I have it? Yikes. Oh, that cooldown on the dash is playing with my emotions right now because it happens just in the nick of time. Whoop. Oh my goodness, my health numbers are very low right now. How is the health so few and far between? Ooh, but we got a cafe and a gym. Hey, so we clear out enough space to put in the gym and it gives us a damage increase when we build it right over here. Perfect. And over here, I think it'd be a good spot for the cafe. Can I take out this big rock here? Oh my gosh. Oh no, I don't have enough bugs for this. Well, at least little old me can take out all this other stuff. And then the cafe gives us a speed increase. Oh, it's actually a lot smaller than I thought it would be, but that can go right next to the library because that's how bookworms are. Are they actually worms in this? I wonder. Hey, we got to level three enrichment and now we have enough money to unlock a new bug. That I have been looking forward to because this banishing blow is mecha. That always means good things. Oh, and he flies around everywhere. That's neat. And he T-poses at the same time. You know he's powerful then. But we can also build a new villager home, which is good because I cleared out all the space here. I need to use it for something. So let's just get a few of those together. And then with four bugs at my disposal, I should be able to take out one of these big rocks. Come on, bugs, help me. Oh, look at the way he's attacking the rock. He's like teleporting everywhere. There we go. But now we're taking it down. This should be a big payout. And it really isn't. Ooh. That's too bad. And we should probably take our dragonfly over to the gym so we get some permanent upgrades. Ooh, hello. Iron Chad. <laughs> oh, yes. I am looking to get swole. Ooh, and these upgrades are really cheap. Let's see. That's probably maximum health there. Some movement speed. Some attraction, I'm guessing. Some experience there. Okay, what does this do? Hey, oh, we start with things? Oh, I love that. But hey, dash cooldown is always appreciated. So at least we get a passive to begin with. And then let's keep upgrading our damage as much as we can. Great, thanks, Jim, bro. Oh, and he's a companion too? I love that. I think me and him should have a good chance in this dark forest now. Oh, he just charges everything down. Look at him go. And he's missing. He is missing entirely. He's like a bull. Ooh, ooh, but that was 54 damage already? Oh, that's amazing. And then why is my guy not attacking? Why is this, what does this do? Oh, it's a dash. 
Oh, I see. Okay. So it's a good thing I got the dash cooldown like I usually do. Ow. Ooh, but the regeneration kicks in already. That's good things because the trees don't really drop health as often as I wish they would. Oh, and there's a big bat already. Well, let's just hopefully take you out as quickly as I can. Ooh, and that's another dashing thing. Throw short distance projectiles around the character. Sure. Let's see what that does. And then it does that. Oh, okay. Those ashes splashes are a little inaccurate, but hey, more attacks on dashing because I'm going to be doing that a lot anyway. Oh, and there's green gems. Ooh, that is an epic epic skill fire spike out of character okay do they persist no but they're constantly going so at least i have a constant attack and they're dealing enough damage to take out things so that's always good Ooh, and there's a rare temporarily stuns enemies oh say no more it's a very small radius though but it stuns them for a good while so when it does happen it's very good i'm feeling a lot better about these upgrades but what i really want to see is that ultimate that mecha green whatever it is it's so good our iron chad dashes and then we throw our shuriken out in a line and that just chops out so many bugs at least we're taking out all the bugs around him and stunning him too. That's extra good. Hopefully I can stun the big spider that rolls up. Okay, and it looks like my shuriken isn't doing the damage that it used to. The bugs aren't going down in one go. So, ooh, hey, there's health. About time. And pretty early too. Oh my gosh, another one? You're spoiling me now. Is this what I get for complaining enough? Oh, the chest is there. Okay. And additional projectile for this because having one leaf is not enough. But now we can casually make our way to the chest. And uh, only one. Ooh, but additional projectile for the spikes. Does that go straight out in front of me? Where does that go? Oh, it fires twice. So that's four more projectiles. Oh, I love this. Hey, and the red spider's here. How nice of you to join us. Now go down. We'll get some damage reduction. I only have one more attack slot left, so I'm not sure what to put there right now. And our ultimate ability is 47% charge, so we're halfway there. But I could definitely use that guy going down because I need to start getting upgrades for my shuriken. I haven't upgraded it at all because the game just hasn't been giving me those upgrades. So thank you for that. Just need to keep stunning the big spider. Yes, he's down. Okay, now I need to work my way over there with a dash and booyah. And it's as the spray that gets upgraded yay maybe i'm just not meant to upgrade this thing for whatever reason oh well but now i'm hoping that the trees that spawn now will have like a banished juice Ooh. hey there it is okay i don't even care what that is time to upgrade the damage so it actually keeps up unless it's so late in upgrading that it isn't keeping up yeah it's so late in the upgrades that it's not doing the one shots anymore still so i just need to take out this giant drag i almost said dragonfly it's a venus fly trap not a dragonfly trap i don't want it to be a dragonfly trap for obvious reasons as i was saying i need to take that out so i get the chest and then more good things because it is also wave nine right now so that big spider is coming up really soon and we'll just keep upgrading the shuriken because there should be another damage upgrade coming pretty soon and the speed upgrade for that is, you know, very well appreciated. Oh, and the health from the trees is also nice. Okay, 87%, 88%. We are almost having that mecha upgrade. But I am still going to save it until... Ooh, magnet! Yes, give me all that XP. More damage for this. Thank you for that. This is going to be the ultimate showdown. Mecha versus giant spider. There's a lot of things that aren't dying as fast as I would like. Okay, but the ultimate is here. So just need to bide our time until the giant spider shows up. Well, hopefully taking out that giant fly trap because how is he still alive? At least the stunning is saving me a whole lot of grief. Oh, ooh, oh what? <laughs> it's not the giant spider. It's a frog that's just rolling at us. Okay, then. Well, giant frog, hope you're ready for mecha green. And oh my gosh, it's a giant mech. <laughs> oh, that is amazing. Just blast through everything. Oh, and get the chest. Okay, that damage goes up. Very good. Get another chest. Get a leaf barrier upgrade as well. Oh, yes. That... Wow, that did so much damage to the frog. It's almost dead. Ooh, that was awesome. Okay, that mecha green was really nice, but my other attacks aren't doing a whole lot of damage to the frog anymore. That's, ow, that's a real big shame. It was so cool to see though. Oh no. Ooh, but an eruption skill or bloodsucker. Ooh, is that leeching? I don't know, but I love that dragonfly so much. I need to give him more upgrades. Like what's the one that increases the ultimate? Is that it with the lightning bolt? I'm gonna guess yes. 
this and just upgrade that a few times and then get some more health regeneration. So hopefully we'll have a good chance against that boss next time. But I think that's a good spot to end the video. Hope you guys enjoyed Cast Out Colony, which is a name right on the gate if you haven't noticed. If you guys want to see more of this game, then be sure to let me know. It's a whole lot of fun. Thank you for watching and sub to intern. And thanks to the channel members, including Bread, Corby Farm, Mr. Cripple One, Dakota, Donomoto, Deviant X, Lucas, Matthew, Hateful Harold, Peggy Sue, Drew Belong, TJ, Susie Sarcastic, Angel, Lily Bites, The Miner Within, DeGary, Sands, Isaac, Miguel, and Zero Fox.